Okay guys, so I'm just gonna show you the experiment, uh, how to set up the potato experiment, okay? All right, so we're gonna have five pieces of potato and we're gonna have five Petri dishes. I've used a Sharpie to label each of them. So zero, five, 10, 15, 20, because that's the grams of salt, sodium chloride, in each of them uh, per litre. All right, now, so what we need to do first of all is we need to get our starting mass for each of our pieces. Just really, really important that you don't mix them up and put them in the wrong um, containers. So just be really super organized with that. So let's say this is gonna be our zero percent. Make sure your scales are on grams and it's on zero. Place your potato on. And then I want you to write down to as many decimal places as you can. So that's going to be the original mass for zero percent or, or zero grams per litre of salt in the water. Put the mass down and then we're going to put it straight into our dish for the zero. And then we're going to do the same thing for the five. Okay, write down the starting mass and that's going to go into the five. Put it straight into the container, the lid on, and then we'll do the same thing with the 20. Okay, I'll write down that mass as well. Okay, so now, next thing we need to do is we need to cover our potato slices with our solutions. Again, really just making sure that they go in the right, uh, the right dishes. Okay, so for the zero grams per litre, that's gonna go on the one that says zero. Now, Really all we need to do is just pour the solution in until the potato is fully submerged. It doesn't need very much. And you're gonna to continue to do the same thing for each of them. I won't do them all now, but that's, that's all we do for each of them. Then, we're gonna um, leave it for as long as we can. Around about 40 minutes would be the minimum. At the end of those 40 minutes, 45 minutes, you can leave it overnight if you really want, but probably most classes will just do it for 40 minutes and you get really, really good results with that. After that period of time, you're going to get them all out and get the final mass. Now, what you need to do is make sure you pat them dry with some paper towel, just very, very gently, but we don't want to measure the mass of the, the water that's on the outside, we're interested to see what's happening to the change in water on the inside. So just pat it dry. Again, make sure your scales are zero. Put the potato on there. Write down your final mass. So that was for zero grams per litre. So we make sure we put in the zero grams per litre column. We can then discard that just dry your scales because there might be a little bit of extra water on there and all of that might actually affect our results. So dry it, zero it, do the same thing with five, 10, 15, 20. Make sure you record it after every one. And then you can go ahead and sit down and work out your change in mass. And it's as simple as that. Good luck.